What's up YouTube, Tom from Tech Stops here coming your way and today I'm doing a review of the Think Tank Photo Street Walker hard drive. This is a really great high quality camera bag which will allow you to fit a whole lot of your pro and consumer SLR, DSLR gear in there. Also holds a 15 inch laptop and it's in a fairly compact design. But what you may not know about Think Tank Photo is their bags are super high quality. The materials they use from the outside material to the way they actually use them to the YKK zippers is really first rate and you do get a whole lot of camera bag for your money. They're really lightweight designs and Think Tank Photo really do think about the end user when they design their bag. So they're all about making a camera bag that not only keeps your gear safe but also allows you to access it really quickly and it has a whole bunch of really great innovative compartments and accessories which really work and uh, really work for the end user. So Think Tank Photo, for those of you guys that don't know them, and you can check them out at thinktankphoto.com. All the links will be below this video. This one retails for $179, and the, all of you that don't know the company, they've been around for a number of years now, and, and the company was established by four people, two designers and two photographers one photographer of which won the Pulitzer Prize in 2005, so they definitely know what they're talking about. And when you get a whole bunch of pro photographers are all around the world using Think Tank Photo bags, you know they're definitely fantastic quality and a really, really good design. So in this video, I'll talk a little bit about the features of this Streetwalker hard drive. You can also see my other reviews. I've got the Airport Antidote and the uh, Shapeshifter as well. So below, when those videos are up, I'll put the links below in the description box. But in this video, I'll talk a little bit about this Streetwalker hard drive, which is a really affordable bag, especially for what you get. Um, and then I'll switch across and I'll show you more of the features in a little bit more in depth. And I'll also fill the bag up with a whole bunch of gear and I'll show you how much you can actually fit You'll be astounded for 179 bucks, especially considering the quality of this bag, how much gear you can actually fit in there. It is a fairly large bag, content-wise, in a small package. Just to give you an example, it's got a whole bunch of you know, little pockets all up the front here, which have all sorts of different uh, compartments, zippers. Put your keys on the little strap there. You can put your all sorts of accessories there. And you know, if you just flip it around the back or on the side, it's got two sort of expandable pockets there for your drink bottles. We've got more zippers there with more sort of uh, little hooks there so you can put more gear in, nice mesh. And if you just flip it around the side, you can just see the quality of the air ventilated back. It's got a nice mesh there. Your back will not sweat with these. There's a nice up and up the spine. There's a nice air pocket there so air can circulate. You've got great padding for your lower back as well. And then if you just look at the camera or the bag straps, this is a typical example of what you get with Think Tank Photo bags that you don't get with most other bags, especially in that sub or mid 200 range. You really won't get it. The padding on these straps is second to none. It's really high quality padding. It's got good memory foam in there, so it really does last. I'll use this for the last couple of months extensively, uh, may I add, and a lot of hiking, and it really did hold up well. There's been absolutely no wear and tear on this bag because it's really high quality use. And just things like all these additional clips and areas to put your mobile or cell phone. Think Tank Photo really do think about the end user. So I can't stress that enough. So if you haven't seen their stuff, go to your local camera store, especially in Australia. In Australia, Think Tank Photo are only really starting to break through in the market. So go to your local store and really demand that they start carrying these, these bags because they're fantastic. So... Let me uh, get into this one in a little bit more detail and show you exactly what it can carry and uh, we'll chat about it just after this. So there's a lot of gear here now in front of you as you can see and all of this stuff will go into this Street Walker hard drive. Like I did say earlier, it's a relatively small package. It's not the smallest bag around but it's relatively small and it's really lightweight and it packs all of this and more. If I had more lenses to throw at it, I would put them in there but just to give you a quick overview, it's got really nice padding, it's really customizable as a lot of bags are, and you can really move it around. There's all sorts, I've got, you know, more padding here which I'm not going to use for this demonstration. So it's really nice up here. As you can see, it's also got attachments which I've left in there. These are plastic lined pockets for weather sealing with nice zippers there. And it's got attachments for your tripod attachments or holders. And you can really put a lot of gear in here. And I do like the fact that it's plastic lined, which is great. 
up the top like I showed you earlier. It's got a lot of pockets, a lot of you know, individual placement, placemats there, so you can put things in different spots, you know exactly where they are. For example, my torch here, which I always carry around for landscape photography, goes right into here, and I know it's always there and good to go. Put a pen in there, it's got a zipper, you've got an attachment for your keys, so you won't lose them. All sorts of nice attachments in here, you know, Pull that out there and you can attach your tripod. That's for your tripod right there, it's a little pouch. So Think Tank Photo really do think about the end user, which is what I was mentioning before. They really do think about you. Zippers are fantastic. Nice pockets on the side there. More sort of places to put your gear in. So absolutely beautiful. But just, first of all, put in, this is just a 13 inch, but it fits a much bigger laptop. Put that in into the side, as you can see there. Slide that in, fits beautifully, nicely padded, and we'll just close it up, and you've got your laptop in there. Flip it around to the back first, and you can see the Streetwalker hard drive really does have a lot of nice padding. Beautiful colors there, good padding for your lower back. You've got a waist strap there, nice ventilation gap, so you get a lot of ventilation coming through there. I'm not sure if you can see, but it's actually a different uh, depth and the actual padding on the straps is absolutely beautiful and it just looks beautiful it just looks fantastic how can you go wrong so flip it around and start putting the gear in so let's get into it 5d and the 5d has a 135 f2 lens on there so pop that right there pop that one on 70 to 200 will go right there 135 the uh, cap will go there. 11 to 16 wide angle for my 400D. 16 to 35. Should put that there. And that's the uh, 17 to 40. 50 millimeter. I forgot to mention earlier. F1.8. Put the flash in the uh, protective pouch. right there 400d beautiful pop that on the side Lumi's camera in his pouch that'll go right there rocket blower right there and we'll just get through to these pouches here Pixel Pocket Rocket and the filter pouch. Close that up. In here I'll put the battery chargers. My flashlights always go at the front there. Nice little place for it there. It's also a nice pouch for my trigger. As you can see, heaps of room still in there. Close that one up. YKK zippers on these, so really sturdy, really strong. Close the Streetwalker hard drive. On the left hand side, I put my pouch. Close that up. On the right hand side, there's nothing in there, so you can still put more in there. Nice pouch on each side for water bottles. Carry case there, you can put your business card there. Important thing to note, if you're traveling or if you want to secure your bag up, the YKK zippers do have a nice little lock um, hole in there, so you can put a lock in there and lock the zippers up. No one will be getting in. Laptop's already in there, and you're ready to go. So that's a Street Walker hard drive from Think Tank. As you can see, it can really carry a lot of gear, so I'd recommend you check them out. And they're really innovative, and when you actually feel these and hold them and put them on your back, and see how they're made. You'll really believe me that they're made of super high quality materials and the people at Think Tank really have thought about the end user when designing these bags. Don't forget to check out my other Think Tank reviews. I've got the Think Tank Shape Shifter and the Airport Antidote V2. Got reviews for them if their reviews are already up, which they will be shortly. Below this video, just down there, I'll, uh, I'll post the, go into the description box and I'll post the links. Post below, I'm always keen to uh, hear from you guys. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you enjoy it. Tom from Tech Stops here. I'll catch you next time.